Welcome! On this video we're doing a product review for the Reba 2 robot, which has been co-developed by Recon and Toka Rubber Industries. So if you want to learn how this care bot is capable of lifting patients from bed to wheelchair, then please stay tuned. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh, oh. Hi guys, I'm Philip English from Robofield.com. Now on this video, we're looking at the Recon and Tokai rubber industry design robot caregiving bot, Reba 2. Reba 2 is a two-arm care support robot that can lift the patient up to 80 kilograms of weight off floor level bedding and into a wheelchair, freeing care facility personnel of one of the most difficult and energy consuming tasks. In Japan, with the elderly population in need of nursing care projected to reach a staggering 5.69 million by the end of 2015, Japan faces an urgent need for new approaches to assist caregiving personnel. In 2009, the Recon Tree Collaboration Centre of Human Interaction Robot Research, that's RTC, a joint project established in 2007 and located in Nagoya Science Park in central Japan, unveiled a robot called Reba one standing for Robot for Interactive Body Assistance, designed to assist in lifting tasks. This is the first robot capable of lifting a patient from bed to a wheelchair and back. Reba 1 charted a new course in the development of caregiving robots, yet functional limitations prevented its direct commercialisation. RTC's new robot, named Reba 2, overcomes these limitations with added power and functionality. New joints in the robot's base and lower back enabled Reba 2 to crouch down and lift a patient off a futon at floor level, the most physical strenuous task for caregivers and one that Reba 1 was not able to do. Reba 2 accomplished the task using a newly developed smart rubber sensors, the first capacitance type tactile sensors made entirely of rubber. Printed in sheets and fitted onto the robot's arms and chest, the sensors enable high precise tactile guidance and allow Reba 2 to quickly detect a person's weight from touch alone, guaranteeing patient safety. Staff can control Reba's motion by directly touching its tactile sensors. Reba's makers say that it is an intuitive control method because of the contact position and force direction coincide with those of the desired motion. By pattern processing, Reba can detect the operator's touch even when the process of lifting is human. Reba has specifically created joint positions and link lengths designed for lifting up a human. Its slim arms and joint structures have high rigidity and a high output torque, while two cameras and two microphones allow it to follow an operator using visual and audio cues. When the operator is within its view, Reba detects the position, direction and distance and moves to the operator's front. Reba also detects sound source direction. When it comes to the design of the robot, the design team asked care assistance workers what the robot should be shaped like. They said that a human type robot might confuse or frighten people with Alzheimer's or autism, but they said that an animal shaped robot would be easier for patients to deal with, hence the design of a bear like robot with the shortened name Robear. Please have a look at the image for the quick specs of the robot, which includes his weight, his height, his payload, tactile sensor areas, his hand vision and audio sensors, as well as operation time and a few of his internal devices. In the future, RTC researchers will work together with partner nursing care facilities to test Reba 2 and further tailor it to the needs of the caregivers and their patients, while also developing new applications in areas such as rehabilitation. TRI aims to bring caregiving robots like Reba 2 to the market in the near future, promising support for ageing populations in countries around the world. Right Reba 2, take me to the shops. Thanks guys, I hope you enjoyed the overview of Reba 2 Robot from Recon and Toko Robot Industries. Now if you like this product review and want to see even more robot reviews, then please hit the subscribe button to keep up to date with the latest videos that come out. Please have a look below as well where I've put links relating to these videos as well as other information about the Reba 2 Robot. If you have any questions or want to see a product review of a particular robot, then please write me a message in the comment section and I'll see what I can do. Thanks guys and I'll see you next time.